I actually work for the person that bought this place. So I don't know if you knew. Are you like an old tenant or? We are the paying the owner. Are you? Um. All right. What's that? What are you here for, Biden? I, I, I work, for, this house just sold. This house just sold. Correct. How you doing? Hi. My name's Chuck. I work for the, the person that just bought this house. So I re, like this like this month I think they they sold it. So are you guys currently paying rent to somebody the I'll old? Just, but I'm paying. Look. Okay. <sighs> My name's Chuck, by the way. I'm Hi, I'm just I'm the, I, I just work for people, investors and stuff that buy properties, and then sometimes these people buy them on auctions and things I've sight been unseen. I've buying this house for the last couple of years. I've been paying the owner who stays right next door. Oh we really? Have a land contract. Do you really? Yeah. Let me get. Can I get your information? Two one six. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm calling him right, goddamn it, now. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I mean, your number. What is it? Two one six. What's your name, man? Takia, T-A-K-I-A. What the fuck? How long you guys lived here? Since 2018. Hello, Damon. There's a man out here saying he just he works for the people that just bought this house. Is this 13600? Yeah. Because you're missing. I, I just I figured it was 13600. Okay. I don't know how the house got sold when he just paid the mortgage last month. That don't make no damn sense. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, I'm just a guy that shows up to question stuff, but I mean, things things do get mistaken, I guess. I, I, I'll i be honest, I don't know, but... I've been on a land contract with this man since 2020. I've been living here since 2018. Okay. And you said he lives there? He lives next door? He lives right there. Cause I'll ask him. I mean, you know, if uh, well, he's coming. Okay. All right. Yeah. I mean, I don't. Uh... I'll be right back. Okay. okay no. No. My name's Chuck. Chuck. You can sit. Okay. No. No. That's cool. I'm cool. I'm over here in East Cleveland doing an occupancy check for one of my new investors who purchased this property. What's his name? Damon. Damon. And you guys have been here since 2018. Okay. Are the utilities in your name? Um, the gas bill is. Okay. Is it possible somebody got scammed? I've been doing this 20 years. I've seen all kinds of stuff, man. It is certainly possible. I'm not going to say it's not. Um, I asked because that was a property I was looking at on Craigslist and it, it turned out to be a scam. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that kind of stuff, stuff on Craigslist, absolutely. You gotta really watch out. Uh, there's a lot of people, and then if they want like Western, they want you to pay like uh, Western Union and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, that's Western. all. That's a red flag scam. That is. He send me a check because I also used to work with a guy. He, I never met him before ever in my life. Mm -hmm. He used to send me plumbing. I, I put on there, I'm a plumber. I need work. Somebody was like, I'll call you when I got jobs. He was sending me all over Cleveland. Yeah. And uh, it was good work. He was sending me checks. I would go uh, put receipts in his P.O. box and stuff. Mm -hmm. and it was great. But uh, then somebody wanted me to do a job where you like, they just, the description was so raunchy. It was like you break into these houses and take pictures for people. So yeah, no. I'm like, man. No, 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 no. I mean, I do. I go into properties and take pictures of people and stuff like that, but they, people know I'm coming. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just don't go into random properties. Certainly not in East Cleveland. <laughs> how, would you get a, how would you get a job like that? Right I've now? been doing this 20 years. I I, I, uh, I used to work for a company that did, handled like uh, uh, foreclosures and stuff. Uh, and then um, I went out and started a data processing company with my ex-wife. And we did that like 15 years. And then I just found investors and stuff that, you know, need somebody willing to go into certain neighborhoods and uh, knock on doors and find out what's going on in properties. 
or they need them secured. They buy a property, you know, anywhere really, and they need them secured. So I just kind of just created it, sort of. But um, what I worry about too is the people renting the properties, like you guys, right. like whether you're legitimately renting it from you know an owner and stuff like that. Now I've had that situation happen where people have been paying money to somebody who they thought was the landlord, and it turns out that it wasn't. And then it actually did sell, and then I show up, and then it turns into a whole. Yeah. Because I'm like. I don't think that's what this is. No, I, pro I don't mean it is. I don't mean that it is. I just mean like I've seen all kinds of weird scenarios and situations. Nothing's, nothing's out of the question. But yeah, yeah. the the person that um, that's telling me they bought it, you know, they said they even told me like we drove by, they drove by and said they saw a couple cars and a ring cam. So I'm like, I know this has got to be the house. And, um, but again, I just, you know, I'm just, I'm just the one to come by and see if anybody's actually here. Sometimes people just park cars in the driveway, just right, to just park cars in the driveway. I don't know. No, 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 man. No, I'm going to, uh. Got all my, I got all my paperwork inside. You're going to have to tell her she'll have to sue. She's going to have to sue them, man, because... Is there something going on? Is there some... Yes, there is. I, fit, so I, I have a feeling. I got all my paperwork. Okay. So we did. I did a land contract with this house in 2017. Okay. I got all my paperwork. Okay. So, yeah, I just I just went onto the, the website just now. Yeah, there, there's, there's fraud going on. Is, is that it? Because I guess they bought it on an auction or sight unseen or something. Sight unseen, probably. Probably. I, I just work for people that buy properties, and then they send me out just to see if anybody's living there, if anybody's there, and stuff like that, because they buy properties all over the east side and stuff. Yeah, they and probably... So, and I, I, again, I know nothing when I'm walking up other than, hey, I bought this property. Can you go there and knock on the door and see if anybody's there? Now, they drove by and said they saw cars here, so they were like, I think somebody's there. But then again, people park in driveways just for the heck of it. So, I didn't right. know. So, you are you the actual owner? Yeah, yeah. So, and you I bought actually, it off of... yeah. Somebody else. When did you get it? I got it in 2017. See, I, okay. see, I got mortgage papers. Okay. I got mortgage papers. Okay, okay. Cool. Hey, man. I, I've seen some weird shit happen. Yeah. Dude, I've been doing this 20 years, man, so I don't rule nothing out. I don't tell anybody anything. Can I get Actually, your name? Damon. Damon. And yeah, it, 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 she's going to she's gonna see. What's your number? Uh, uh, 216. Okay. Uh, and you uh, said uh, you uh, had uh, it since 2017. Uh, Eleanor. It's her name, right? The, the person that just bought it, or the person who that claiming, had it? who claiming to? No. Oh yeah, see, it's a bunch of frogs. See, I, I, now I see already. I'm not gonna tell you who sent me out here, mm -hmm. but but it ain't. That's not her name. Mm-hmm. You see? Okay, see. man. All right, right. I just, I just, I'm here to get information, and then we'll get it worked out or whatever. I don't know anything other than. My, the people I work for, they buy houses and stuff. And Matter of fact, it took me a minute to get out here because I was looking for my last mortgage paper so you can see. Because that's what they were saying, that you paid the, the mortgage. So I can see, you can see my last mortgage. Who, who's, who's, who are you paying the mortgage to? The, uh, the Nana. The Nana. The Nana was the last owners. Matter of fact, they still, until the until the uh, what, what, what water that? got changed over, they were still uh, they were still sending the Nana water bills. How do you, they, who's a Nana? Nanana, N E N A N A uh, 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 LLC. N E N A N A LLC. It's an LLC. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, man, I've seen some. So now I gotta hire somebody to find out who is claiming to have this house because I can. And well, so yeah, I mean, be lawsuits, lawsuits coming out. Well, I mean, there's certainly a situation. They just gotta figure out what you know who the rightful owner was now the, the now i'm gonna tell you straight like the person that sent me out there they're holding the deed so it was fraud so they what they meaning did what was, you did what you got involved in or no, not what i got involved in them selling reselling the house man i was just watching some stuff about selling it oh wow selling a deed somebody can go anybody can make up a deed and oh, go yeah. down there and change that deed well that's what i mean she's telling me and it's it's a female i'll tell you that much it's a female i but already know her name her name okay. is uh her name is uh where's the water bill charlene charlene is that it right so that's so so the, the nana to get out of paying that high water bill that they weren't paying when we were paying them okay they switched it over and so told me that it was okay all right you, you could just start paying that water bill okay I, I, all right, I'm, I'm, I'm right. hearing everything so you're saying. Did, so what, that's what I'm, they did I'm, before this house was paid off. 
they did that and and then so that's what they must have did they must have put it in her name right because nanana had just went through a lawsuit in utah because i got all the paperwork for that okay they went in a lawsuit for utah about them buying houses sight unseen and it that, was, it was, that company that, that company that company they're, they're, they're located out of utah Utah. out of uh it's called jordan okay uh it's, it's jordan it might be just another name with it's jordan utah because i remember it was sounded like a, a biblical name as a city but uh, you said you're paying you said you're paying the mortgage to them it's though. over with though it's oh. over with though i'm supposed to get i was supposed to get paperwork for this house so what they did uh, is they, they they tried to sell it, that, but they they get ready. Uh, I got uh, all just, the paper. Okay, all right, all right. I'm gonna go back and tell them like, hey, here's what this is what's going on. If there's if you got five minutes, I'm getting ready to show you because I was mm -hmm. I was before I came down. I, that's what I was mm -hmm. doing. I was going through my drawer looking oh, yeah, yeah. for it. Oh, Let I'm, me grab it for you. Okay, real quick. all right, yeah, yeah, man. Go ahead, go ahead. I got time, no problem, man. Stuff, but I do hear some screwball stuff man like i hear stuff where family members are living there and then they claim that they're bought it off the uncle but the uncle passed away so you can't prove it but they're saying nah nah i got this you know arrangement set up or whatever and it's like but then it goes through probate or whatever and then it gets foreclosed on and then the you know the city or the bank gets it and then they sell it and then my guy that bought it i show up and it's like holy crap we got a whole situation here like you know a family you know, I get it. Family own it, and the kid or you know relative right, moved in. Scam, though, because, um, but it's it's certainly and this you know scams are out here. They're happening. People don't think so. There's people that sell houses. Yeah, but I just got him to give me. Um, I just got him to get a breakdown of what was old and what wasn't. Uh huh. Just a few months ago. Really? Yeah. Like we keep up with this stuff because I got kids and I'm trying to be in a land. Sure. Oh we yeah. Did a land contract before, but I've been working with him since. He used to have it as like a rooming house. And oh, okay. I moved in with my kids as a rooming house. And then he bought that house because he was like, I'm gonna get y'all a house where you could just live with your kids. Okay. And it'll still be where they school is. Right, so right. He bought that house, but it was a problem with that house. So he told me I can keep this one. Uh -huh. He moved all the rooming people out. Okay. And he let me keep this one. So I had to move for a couple of months to get things worked out or whatever. And when I came back, he was like, you know, you could do a rent to own. Right. And I was like, fuck that. Can we do like something else? Where yeah. I don't have to go through the bank because I really don't like dealing with. Well, I don't. I'm blaming. You. I'm, I'm, I'm out here grinding seven days a week doing this kind of stuff, you know. And it sucks when I run into these situations because. I don't work for like uh, slum lords or anything like that. I work for guys that buy properties in low income, you know, these kind of neighborhoods, and try to fix them up and save the neighborhood so they don't exactly. end up like vacant lots and uh -huh. stuff. I've been working in these neighborhoods for 20 years. I know that's right. So, I Where mean, I've from? seen it. I'm from uh, Collinwood, actually, Five Points. Mm -hmm. I grew up in Five Points. It's 152nd that's in that. school, 152nd no, exactly in home. That's, yep. that, yeah. that's, where that's where I used to get yeah, all kinds of fun. trouble in the 90s. I'm from New Jersey, though. <laughs> oh, you really? Oh, yeah. I grew up here. I've, I've been here my whole life, so. Okay. They called his mortgage company right here, so that they'll, they'll be able to give me all the, all of my uh, statements. You see that? That's okay. me, Damon Baker. All right. This is this is this is for this address. This is, okay. This is for this address. I got so you. this is this is a uh, this is our loan number. This is all my right. loan number right okay. here. Okay. This, this is for this address. So all right. See, this is Nana, yeah, yeah, South yeah, yeah. Jordan. Remember, I said it was it's South it's Jordan, Jordan, Utah. Utah. Okay. So so there's so there's paperwork about a lawsuit between the nana llc and the lady okay which i mean i just i just i get information so i, I just is, i just gather information send it back Yep. this is this is the, this is their this is their address see i had to do all this research myself yeah i'll go i'll go back and uh like i said i got your number because i gotta just give it to them and then they'll be in touch and then y'all have to work it out <laughs> You know, what I mean, so like, I he's going to get in touch with me. Well, I don't know if that's if that I'm not going to say who I soak with, but okay. I mean, if that's if that's who the person is, I mean, they'll, they'll get in touch with you, man. And then you guys okay. can figure it out. I don't know. I mean, I'm just a verifier. I just show up, knock on the door, see what's going on. Yeah, I'm probably going to get my attorney on the But, document. yo, I would. Oh, yeah. absolutely, man. Because this sounds like there's some shenanigans going on. And, and I go back to my the person that paid. sent me here, and uh, I just tell him, look, man, if you got some shenanigans going on or some bullshit, I want out. I don't get involved in that. I, I got I got too much going on. Well, that's it. Yeah, and I don't, I mean, I, I'm walking into it just trying to figure out what's going on. It and be so ugly. That shit is dangerous. Oh, it is. My whole job is dangerous. Yes, it is. That's dangerous. <laughs> I just thought about that. Like, what if we were some goddamn... 
Oh, I've had guns pulled on me. I've had yeah, yeah, I've yeah. had dudes come out, and I don't I've. Think I'm on, I'm on no trash, and I said I'm gonna be right back. You know. Oh, yeah. when you said you would be right back, I went back in the house. You noticed I walked over here because oh, no, yeah. I didn't know if you were gonna come out with a street sweeper. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. man. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. I, like I said, I'll, I'll 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 go back to them and tell them what's up, and then they'll get in touch with you, man. You guys figure it out. Okay, please and tell I'm, them. Please tell them to contact me ASAP. I will. 100%. Because I'm, I'm gonna contact my lawyer. No, no, no. I, I will, man. Because this gonna be a lawsuit. That's a straight up lawsuit right here. Yeah, absolutely, man. Lawsuit. There's all kinds. I'm, I'm really like, I, I hope it is a lawsuit. <laughs> I hope it is too, man, because I don't like seeing people get screwed out of their houses and shit. I really don't. I'm not in that business to put people out that are supposed to be there. I'm here to put people out that ain't supposed to be there. Right. So that's the difference. So if you're supposed, you know, if everything's legit, great. If you know, that's things happen, man. Paperwork happens and shit happens. I, I don't know anything more than. Just knocking on the door and seeing what's what. But hey, thanks for y'all's time. I'm gonna give them their your information right away. Okay. And then they'll be in touch, I'm sure. Y'all figure it out, man. Hopefully Absolutely. you don't see me again. All right, what's your name? My name's Chuck Taylor. Chuck Taylor. Okay, can't forget that. Man. Can't forget it, man. Can't Bye. forget it. Take it easy, guys.